Hey, I'm Dr. Joffrey. We're going to jump right into the series of men's health. Today, we're going to talk about the five uh, health and social conditions that uh, impact men uh, 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 greatly. Now, who is this talk for? If you are a wife, uh, if you're a man, if you're a brother, if you're someone who loves men, if you're a sister, or you're just a friend of a man. Great talk. Let's let's jump right into the number one condition uh, that impacts men different cardiovascular disease. Now, later talk, we're going to go into greater detail. But cardiovascular dis disease disproportionately impacts men. Now, there's a subset of that that we, that we will get into later. But hypertension. Hypertension is also known as a silent killer. Hypertension directly and indirectly kills men at a disproportionate rate. Number two, prostate issues. So men who were born men have prostates. Prostates can become cancerous. In fact, it's the second leading cause of death in men is prostate cancer. We're gonna talk about that in a later video. Two, three, mental health challenges. Yeah, I get it. And I agree with you. Everyone has mental health challenges. But for some reason, when it comes to men, they don't seek help as often. And when they do seek help, it's often at, at a later phase than, say, women. Uh, four, erectile dysfunction. Um, erectile dysfunction is basically uh, difficulty uh, uh, getting an erection and maintaining an erection. While for some that seems small, it's a, it's a, it presents uh, uh, major social issues that can impact men's health and men's mental health. And then finally, workplace related injuries. Yes, men are often the ones who um, not only, but more often uh, take on some of the more difficult, uh, life-threatening jobs like um, uh, high-rise construction, um, coal mining, manufacturing, uh, 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 those when you're driving down at, at night and working on the side of the road. Uh, so men disproportionately are in, those, uh, are in those environments. Hence, it makes sense that they're more likely to have work-related injuries. In this series, we're going to talk about all of this, and we're going to talk about ways that we can improve the health and the safety of men. If you found this video helpful, be sure to subscribe, share, or even leave a comment. I'll see you on the next video.